To create an Azure Monitor alert, we need to go to the Azure console and either click on Monitor on the left-hand side here, or go up to All Services and type in Monitor. Once we're in the Monitor blade, we need to go to Alerts on the left-hand side here, and then we'll go into Manage Alert Rules in order to create a new alert rule. However, first, we're going to take a look into Manage Action Groups, and just notice that we've got an Action Group preset up here with some details of Frank's email address here, so this action group will email the alerts out to Frank. So if we go back to our alerts and click on Manage Alert Rules, we can go through the process of creating a new alert rule. So first we need to select a target. So I'm going to select my subscription and I'm going to filter it down to the resource that I want to alert on. In this case, it's going to be virtual machines. So we could scroll down here and select a particular virtual machine. I'm going to leave it selected at the top here so that it's doing it for the whole subscription. And the selection preview at the bottom there will give you a list of what is selected. So if you click on done, we're going to add a criteria to this alert. So in this case, I want to use start a virtual machine. I want it to alert me every time a virtual machine is started. However, there is an awful lot of pre-configured alerts here. So we can select on when a virtual machine is powered off or a virtual machine is captured, etc, etc. So I'm going to select on start a virtual machine and click on done. And if we go to the second section, we can give the alert a name. So I'm going to call it VM started and give it a description. And then I need to select on a resource group to create this alert in. And I'm going to leave the enable rule upon creation selected as yes, because I want that to be enabled as soon as I can. And notice the alert here that may take up to five minutes for the alert to become active. So in the third step here, we need to select on the action group that's pre-created. So we select the action group one that goes off to Frank's email and click on add. And then finally, create the alert rule at the bottom here. So now if we go over to our virtual machines and start one of them up, it should trigger our alert. So if we go over to Frank's email here, we should see an alert appear in a few moments in his mailbox. And there we go, the alert has arrived. And if we click on the alert, it should give us some information about the device that's been started and the alert. Thanks for watching.